Hi everyone, this is Gail from Ladyfinger Sewing Center in beautiful Ole, Pennsylvania. We just got in some new arrivals from M&S Textiles. Our Aboriginal print selection is quite broad and we added the brand new designs that just arrived. So I wanted to share them with you and so that you get a, a nice view of what these fabrics really look like. We also got in pre-cuts. Um, these are two brand new pre-cuts that, that um, M&S did for us and we have layer cakes and five by five squares that uh, come in two colorways, greens and blue. So you can see the greens here. These are the layer cakes, which are 10 by 10 squares. There may be some duplicates. Um, that's normal for M&S. I don't know for a fact, but I'm sure there are probably some duplicates in here. It doesn't matter. They're all absolutely gorgeous and very, very usable for your projects. Here's the blue colorway. And then you can also see that we have the five by five squares in uh, blue and green as well. Now on to the yummy fabric folds that just came in. And I know these are not gonna last long. So if you want them, come and get them. This one is a kangaroo grass and bush water hole in red. And you can see the vibrancy. There's a lot of movement, but they're very cuttable and usable. And um, I believe this is Roseanne. Yes, Roseanne Wharton designed these and she always does a great job. This pattern also comes in blue and purple. There are 21 pieces in all. <clears throat> if you would like cuts of all of them, I certainly can make that happen. Uh, the next, Fabric, look at this. This one is called Lemongrass Green, and this one is by Sharon Peltar Briscoe. Absolutely gorgeous. I could see a dress made out of this. Be really cute for uh, tableware, and certainly in some really bright, happy quilts. So this is the green colorway. Also comes in a uh, yellow. And a, let me make sure, a red. Sometimes the color designations don't match what's actually on the fabric, but they, pretty, they seem to be pretty good this time around. Okay, next design. I think this is so pretty. This is Kangaroo in the Forest Gold by Roseanne Morton. Now, I don't know where the kangaroos are. Maybe you do, but it doesn't matter. It's such a splendid print. It's happy. The scale is a medium size, so it's quite usable. And it's just the perfect shade of, of mixed greens with a little bit of gold flowers on it. Also comes in uh, br what they're calling brown, <laughs> which is everything. But I guess there's a little tiny bit of brown in there, but it's a beautiful mixed color. And also kangaroos in the forest, and this is the multicolor way. Next, we have uh, women, uh, well, let's see, women watching stars at night, and this one is in brown. Really beautiful, make a great border. Also comes in olive and purple. Here we go. Next, we have this one is Bush Tucker After Rain in, I don't know, in NT. I'm not sure what that's supposed to mean, by uh, Marion Doolin. And so this one is blue. This is a great fabric. Look at that. So much energy. So many little surprises. It's a, this is a wonderful one to add to your stash and put in your projects. Same pattern in green oh no this one's considered yellow pardon me isn't that great and then we have it as well in purple it's a pinky purple but it's it's absolutely beautiful this is a new this is a very new style this one's honey flowers in gold i know this won't last this is so great for for fall um 
or any time of the year, but it has a nice flow to it. It's not the usual dots. It's a, it's a more uh, painterly look. So really, really great. Also comes in blue. And this one is considered pink. So it's a multicolor, but they're calling it pink. Now this one is an almost solid and we have three colors on this, but this is called bushworm. And this one is in olive. Nice resting spot for the eye. This one's nice too. This one is bushworm in brown. So it's kind of a rust color and it has little specks of a, a kind of a purpley indigo-y kind of color with a little bit of orange and gold and yellow. And this one, this one won't last either. This one's in blue, but there's multicolored dots on it, just enough to give the fabric special interests. So I hope that you go to ladyfingersewing.com, go in the search bar, just type in Aboriginal and all of these and all of the rest of our inventory of gorgeous Aboriginal fabrics will be there for you to purchase. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.